Hi everybody and welcome back to Reef Mechanic. Let's talk about plates. Alright, like this little guy. This is actually a very rare plate. This is a baby blue pink short tentacle plate. They are amazing and they will actually form and take to your rock. They actually do very well on rocks. You, they, you can go on, on sand bed, nothing wrong with that. But they actually do a lot better when they're on rocks. And a lot of people don't know that. A lot of people just put them on a sand bed and think, you know, oh, they're going to be, it's it's going to be okay there. And yeah, 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 it is. It's not a problem, whatever. But they do a lot better when they're on the rocks. Not only that, these things are, are pretty cool when you got long tentacle or a short tentacle. They can, you can get them the size of a dime. You can get them. They'll, it can grow as big as three, four inches wide. I've seen them some, some bigger. Um, one of the cool things about them is that when they eat, eat, um, all their tentacles kind of push everything towards their mouth, and the and the mouth opens up actually fairly wide, and then it swells up like a little tiny cone. Now this is another thing to know about these guys, is that if you do not have them properly placed with your current. They love to swell up with water sometimes. They'll just blow themselves up like a puffer fish. And then with the current, when current comes along, they'll actually just take off with the current a bit and they'll float elsewhere. There's just a little reminder about plates. They have a hard bottom, they got a soft top. But when you put them on rocks and stuff, they love to bend in form to them. You know, they do a lot better on them. So that's just a little tiny tip about plates here, all right? Have a, night, a good night, you guys. Remember to like and subscribe to Reef Mechanic.